Shreyas did his B.Tech from Chemical Engineering. Shreyas is getting this top 50 rank in Gate CS 2025 in his first attempt. He started his preparation from the May 2024. These are very frequent questions, Shreyas. You know, students, they will ask, Sir, I am from non-CSE background. Can I create Gate exam, you know, in Computer Science? Second frequent question is, Sir, can I create Gate exam? Can I get a top rank in first attempt? You, you have answered both the questions in a, in a single interview. Hi everyone, welcome to Go Classes. Today we have with us Shreyas Shetty, who is expecting all India rank 34 to 36 in GATE CS 2025 exam. Shreyas was Go Classes complete course enrolled student and we are very happy and proud of him. Shreyas, thank you for joining us in this session and congratulations for this amazing achievement. Thank you, sir. It's so, a pleasure sir, to be here. So Shreyas, please introduce yourself. Yes. Hi, everyone. I'm Shreyas and I am from Bangalore. So I have completed my B.Tech uh, in Chemical Engineering from NIT Karnataka. In uh, 2022, I've graduated. And after that, I have worked for uh, two years. And uh, since May 2024, I have been full time preparing for the gate. And I've enrolled for the complete course in Go classes. So, so yes. Shreyas, you did your B.Tech in the Chemical Engineering. Correct. In 2022, you were, uh, you completed your B.Tech and uh, uh, then like you were doing some job, right? Yes. So actually, uh, in my second or third year, I uh, realized that uh, chemical engineering is not suitable for me. So I have, uh, you know, in for one year, I practiced uh, DS, DS structures algorithms. And that was enough for me to get a fresher job uh, as software engineer. And uh, I have worked for uh, two years as a SD only software engineer. So, Sirius, when did you decide to prepare for the GATE computer science exam? When did you start your preparation? Yeah, so around uh, March 2024, I decided that uh, I have to go for higher studies to explore more in computer science. So, in March 2024, I have uh, applied, I have quit my job and I saw a notice period for two months. Uh, and uh, although I used to study for one hour, one hour a day in those two months, I like properly started preparing in May 2024. So initially I had plans of uh, giving both uh, CS and uh, DA paper. So I, uh, I have prepared for uh, linear algebra in those two months. Uh, yeah. From the co-classes, uh, such in search course. Yeah. I have enrolled in both uh, CS and uh, DA codes in co-classes. You started your preparation actually in the month of May because you were servicing your, you were serving your notice period. So in that period, you could not get enough time for the gate preparation as you are saying that every day, only one hour you were getting. Right. Yeah. It was actually a startup. So it was work was a bit hectic. And so only linear algebra I could complete uh, in those two months. So overall, basically your preparation actually started from, from the May month. And uh, then yeah. you, then you prepared uh, from Go classes, you prepared and you were enrolled in Go classes, Gate CS and DA both courses. So uh, did you prepare for both the exam? No, in uh, May, actually, I realized that uh, it will be too much, uh, uh, in eight months to prepare for both. So I have, from then I prepared only for the computer science. Okay. Fully, f you, you were fully focused on only get CS preparation. Correct. Yeah. Okay. So what was your experience with the go classes course? Did you complete the go classes course? Did you like it? Yeah. Like, as I said before, uh, uh, except for uh, data structures, algorithms, every other subject was completely new to me. So, uh, uh, like I have, uh, learned every, everything from go classes like all the other subjects so the experience has been extremely enjoyable and uh, fulfilling for me learning from go classes and uh, and actually uh, you guys have made it very easy to understand things so it was a great experience and uh, i could cover it i could cover the syllabus in around 6 7 months because of the way of teaching and uh, uh, and the strong concepts conceptual understanding yeah so Shreyas, when did you start attempting the test series? So in mid of December, I was start, I started attempting the test series. And before that, did you attempt the weekly quizzes that we provide in our course? Yeah, I used to uh, attempt uh, weekly quizzes and uh, also I have attempted subject wise quizzes, but uh, the full line mock test, I started from the mid of December. So during your preparation, you were attempting the weekly quizzes, also the subject test, topic wise test, these tests you were attempting during your preparation. And from the month of December, after completing your syllabus, 
you started attempting the mock test, the full length mock test you started attempting in the month of December. Right. Yeah. Subject wise test. Uh, when I completed a particular subject, I used to take it. Yeah. And how did you attempt the topic wise test? Did you attempt it after a test uh, after a topic was over? Did you attempt the topic wise test or after the subject was over? You attempted subject wise topic wise test of that particular subject. Yeah. So once a topic used to be completed, I used to take the weekly quiz, whatever used to be there. And then once that subject is completed, then I used to take the test series for that uh, subject wise test for that subject. Okay. So Suresh, what was your experience with the full length mock test in the last two months, December, January? What was your experience with the all India mock test? Yeah, my experience was very good because uh, initially in the first mock test, which I took, I used to initially score around only 60, 65. But uh, I think the quality of questions are very good. And uh, first of all, they cover the basic concepts. They ensure that you know the basic concepts. And uh, uh, moreover, they also we also like they also ask the uh, new new type of questions that can be asked in the gate exam. Like in many subjects, they can, they were a very new type of questions which were not there in any PYQs or anything. So that helped in again uh, strengthening the concepts. So it was very useful, and I have attempted almost all the full length mock test. And uh, in the last two weeks, uh, my marks increased to seventy five to eighty. So that's awesome. So. Sres, actually in our course, you already know that we teach the concepts in depth with proof. So did you like this proof based learning whenever you were learning some concept and with proof you are learning some formula, theorem, result, property, then uh, did you did you enjoy that that proof based learning? Yeah, it was very helpful, the proof based learning. Um, I mean, understanding the entire concept because I realized it uh, um, in the end, like in January, what is the importance of it? Because I did not have to remember many things, like many list of formulas, like all the concepts were clear and, uh, and uh, I could apply wherever I wanted because of the proof based understanding. Although, although it, uh, although I spent some extra time in understanding the proofs and concepts, but once it gets into your head and uh, like nothing can remove it. Out. Yeah, that's the benefit. Actually, when we memorize something, when we do the rote learning, then uh, for a moment, it feels okay that we have saved a lot of time. But uh, then we have to, you know, after 10 days, we will forget it. Then we will have to do the revision again, do the memorization. Again, after 10 days, we will forget it. So that is the problem with the memorization. But with the understanding, this is the benefit that once you understand something in the proper way, then it will be very hard to forget it or or maybe after two three months you just have to you know quickly uh, glance over it and uh, it will be i can say fresh in your mind right correct so to all the students i want to say that sres did his btech from chemical engineering and he has and he is getting top 50 rank in gate cs 2025 exam that is inspirational and more incredible thing is that sres got this achievement Sres is getting this top 50 rank in Gate CS 2025 in his first attempt. He started his preparation from the May 2024 and now you can see after 8 or 9 months of preparation, he is now getting a top 50 rank, maybe a top 35 rank he can get. So top 50 rank is there, that is confirmed. Of course, expected rank is 34 to 36. But uh, so Sres, this is really incredible that, uh, you know, these are actually these are very frequent questions, Sres. You know, students, they will ask, Sir, I am from non-CSE background. Can I create gate exam, you know, in computer science? Second frequent question is, Sir, can I create gate exam? Can I get a top rank in first attempt? You you have answered both the questions in a, in a single interview. Both the questions have been answered because we are getting so many messages, Sir, I am from mechanical background, Sir, I am from civil background. Can I crack the gate CS exam. Then next next time I am going to give your interview, this interview link I will provide to them. Just watch it. And that too in just, you know, first attempt in just nine months, you you got this rank. So that is really incredible. Uh, congratulations to you, Sres, uh, and kudos to you. Thank you, sir. And uh, like uh, I have to tell, uh, Go class is exceptionally good. Like, I mean, uh, if we, uh, like, suppose, I could not read all the textbooks in six, seven months, but in Go classes, you have just curated the 
all the required things uh, in the, from the standard textbook and you have provided us uh, so that we can save our time uh, and uh, achieve a result faster sirs do you know some magical moment can you remember can you recall some magical moment when you were watching our lectures at some moment did you feel wow maza aa gaya ye concept seekh ke maza aa gaya i enjoyed it so any magical moment that you can recall right now yeah actually i have enjoyed uh, all the courses but speaking of specifically one uh, in operating system i think i was studying multi level paging so for the first time it's little bit difficult to grasp but uh, when uh, sachin sir explained how uh, explained uh, like how the number of bits required to uh, store the inner level page table and uh, all the memory allocations between different page table so that was fascinating for me to learn yeah thank you thank you sirs for sharing your journey with us we are we wish you the best for the gate 2025 result definitely your rank will be in the top 50 but uh, we wish you that you get this expected range that you are getting 34 to 36 we wish that you get your rank in this range only so uh, thank you sirs for joining us in this session and if you have anything to say to the future aspirants please share yeah i would first of all thanks sir, and uh, for having me here and uh, for future aspirants i would like to say that uh, please focus on conceptual understanding and uh, uh, keep revising regularly and solve a lot of problems and it will ensure a good rank in gate so with sirs we will have a detailed interview after the gate 2025 results are out we will have a detailed interview where we will discuss each and every small small point about his preparation so uh, i think from this interview students who are from non csc background and students who want to crack the gate exam in the first attempt they can learn a lot they can get inspiration from this interview so thank you sirs for joining us in this session thank you for your time and congratulations again many congratulations thanks a lot sir.